Twin Cities Radio listeners about to get a double dose of sports talk. KSTP AM announced today it is switching formats from all talk to all sports talk. Here's Carol Evans, Carla Holt. Longtime local sports pundit Patrick Royce, it all came down to this. So we were kind of in no man's land. A station without an identity, some say KSTP AM suddenly needed to find one. And so beginning Monday, it will switch to all sports all the time, eventually taking on the name 1500 ESPN Twin Cities. We're going to have the ESPN brand within 60 days, and uh, that is an extremely powerful uh, brand. Uh, in the sports world, they basically own the sports world. Along with the change in format, there's change in on-air hosts. Royce and Joe Souchere will stick around, both of them now in the afternoons. But the mornings will be left to ESPN. I saw KSDP making a change. Their ratings have been lousy. Clear Channel Operations Manager Greg Swedberg may have predicted the change, but at this point, he and others overseeing reigning sports king K-Fan aren't worried. They don't plan on changing a thing. In fact, he says he's surprised KSTP is giving up on going local. But to give half your day up to a national format, it's not something we'd want to do on our, our sports station. But bottom line, with KSTP's arrival on the sports scene, the market now has four stations dabbling in sports. Time will tell. Carlson School of Management professor George John says with all the competition in political talk radio, there's no question KSTP needed to jump into a new format. Now it's about whether all sports stations can survive. This market, you know, if you think about it, has all the professional sports. It has a Big Ten school, so there's enough. Um, there's enough grist for the mill if you think if you think that way. It should be noted at least nine people lost their jobs in today's announced format change. Now, I also talked with MinPost.com's David Brower tonight. He says plummeting ratings played a big part in the KSTP decision, and he says so did the Minnesota Twins. KSTP, which is the current radio home of the Twins, wants to keep them. And so they're going to make it as sports-friendly as possible on their station. Well, job loss is never good in any industry, no, for sure. No, it certainly isn't. Thank you, Carla. Mm -hmm. mm.